What's up, everybody? Appreciate you for tuning into the channel again. Uh, today, I'm going to be removing this dash trim piece to change out the start button because mine is really faded. So, um, all right, let's do it. So, first things first, I've got a couple of different tools here. Uh, I've got a screwdriver just in case I have to screw off anything or anything else. But these pieces are plastic pieces. You always want to use plastic for dash trim piece and everything. So first thing I'm gonna do is start over here. On this side right here, what you're gonna do is put it in here, and pry on it right there. Until it pulls up. Right, that side is up. Then you're gonna come over on this side and do the same thing. That one pulls up. So now I'm gonna take this big one, go right here in the middle, and pry on that, and pry on that one also. Damn, it's out. So now there are a couple clips down here that you're gonna have to undo. Uh, first there's one for the start button itself. Just squeeze it and wiggle it loose. Two clips on both sides. Then for the AC, pull that out. You don't have to squeeze that one, you just pull that one out. And same thing. So both of these clips right here are just pull out. You don't even have to squeeze them. This one you have to do have to squeeze it to pull that one out. All right, so this right here now, pretty simple. So I'm gonna pull this, squeeze on these two tabs right here, push, the button comes out. So now what I'm going to do, is I'm gonna go ahead and head inside so you can see it better and switch over. So mine looks like that kind of scratched up so I ended up getting a piece over here too so let's go do that alrighty so first thing I'm gonna do is remove this piece here on the side just gonna pry it up lift up there lift up there just go around it Take off this piece here. Good, got it. All right, so now that that's off, so first thing I'm gonna do here is this piece is actually going to stay on because I'm just putting over a piece over here. That's all I'm doing with that. So let me see here. Cool. All right, still in. All right, so now this piece here this is the actual button. Just gonna go ahead and actually, I'm gonna use a clip pick. All right, so now I'm gonna use a pick. I'm just gonna go ahead and pry around it, lift that up here on this side. Lift this side right here. That one's up. That one's this side. Just do the same thing all around to all four different pieces. The clip is out. This part is the downside. So you want to make sure you put this back on. Just like that. Couple presses. Good. Looks good. Alright. So now this has some pieces on it that I don't need anymore. So I'm just going to scrape that off. So I can make sure it has better st uh, sticks better.
I'm gonna take this to him. Pull that off. Put that right in there. Just like that. So now to install this back, you have this dowel right here, and then it go lines up at the top up here. So you'll take that, slide it right back over, and press down. And voila, we are done. Let's go put it back in the car. All right, so now we're gonna put it back in. So obviously, I'm gonna go this part upward, start the base down. Just push on it, snaps it right back in. Cool. So now we're gonna go ahead and clip back in these right here. Um, go ahead and check that out. All right, so. I took out this center piece because it'll probably be easier to put it in like that. So now I'm going to go ahead and drop this down. Start buttons in. I'm gonna feed these through here. Make sure everything's lined up. Right back in place. And then all you're gonna do is just press down. Make sure everything's bad. You take this one, big side, big clip, little to little clip. And then press right back in. Boom. All right, start button is in. Still good. Everything works. Works well. And just make sure everything's pressed down. And that's it. That's how you install your start button. Appreciate you guys for watching another video. As always, like, subscribe, drop a comment, and I'll post the link in the description below for the button so you guys can pick up your own. Alright, until next video.